So I got this pillow today as a birthday present thing. It's very lovely, as I put it in frame in front of my face. Uh, yeah, it's comfy, and I like it. Thank you for who got me this pillow, because I like it. It's very nice. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to <coughs> a video. <laughs> Today I am gonna be. This is this is my birthday special, uh, as you probably know from the title. I'm gonna be answering a few questions now. I shouldn't be doing this video for several reasons, uh, because I have exams. I am uh, ill, as you probably can hear and see. Uh, but I've decided to do it anyways. Uh, so yeah, I have some questions here in front of me on my PC. As you probably can see, I, I assume that you have a webcam somewhere in the top something corner. Uh, I don't know. Uh, anyways, let's uh, start off. Now you're going to answer me. Answer me? Now you're going to ask me. Uh, why didn't you ask us for like the questions? Why did you take them from online and stuff? Because I was not going to do this video. Uh, because I was, like, I was, I wanted to celebrate my birthday, and I didn't want to work, but then I got sick, uh, and I realised that if I do, uh, this video this year while I'm sick, I can keep it as an anniversary thing, uh, so I don't get lazy when, uh, my birthday comes, and I say, oh, well, you've, you've done it when you're sick, do it again. So, yeah, because I wanted to do it, like, for the past two years, and I've just gotten lazy and never did it. So, yeah, we're, we're doing uh, 50 questions you've never been asked, I think. That's the title. Anyways, let's get into the first one. What's your favourite... Excuse me. Uh, what's your favourite candle scent? I don't know, it didn't really have a lot of can candles, but it's probably... probably will be vanilla. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm drinking stuff in my... M&M's uh, cup. It's quite lovely. Uh, I'm drinking stuff to so that this illness can go away. I'm gonna have a sip. I'm I'm gonna drink this while I'm uh, answering. Hope for you. Ho hope for you. Hopefully you you don't mind that. Quick sip. Ah, God, that is lovely and warm. Doesn't taste good, anyways. It's um, hang on. It's chamomile with anise. They're lovely people. Uh, <laughs> number two, what female celebrity would you wish was your sister? Um, none, because I like my sister. If I hated my sister, I'd probably go for Adele, because she's like she's she does swear a lot, as she said in several interviews. But she's I, I she's a lovely person from what I've seen. So yeah, probably her. What male celebrity do you wish was your brother? Uh, again, same question. I love my brother. I don't want to want him to be released, uh, released, replaced. But uh, if I did have to, I'd probably <laughs> pick uh, Benedict Cumberbatch purely because he plays Sherlock Holmes. That is the only reason. Actually, I might go for uh, Jeremy Clarkson just purely because he again is. Uh, Jeremy Clarkson. He's he's the most amazing person on the planet. Uh, do you know? Ah, uh, uh, no. Number four. I'm getting off track, off topic already. Uh, do you know how old do you think you'll be when you get married? Uh, Seven billion nine hundred and ninety-nine. Because I'm never going to get married. Uh, I I just hate the concept of marriage. It's just it's just it's just so unnatural. It's like have you seen? Like a group of sparrows gathering their sparrow friends, and one of them is wearing a, a wedding gown and on a tree branch. It's like in the name of the fun. Like it never happens. Like we're the only species on this earth that never that ever gets married, and it's horrible. Also, I don't like babies. Horrible thing. It's just it cries. It's, it's too much. It's it's horrible. Uh, number five. Uh, do you know a hoarder? No, I don't even know what a hoarder is. Uh, can you do a split? No, even if I couldn't, I probably 
if 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 I could, I probably uh, wouldn't do it right now because uh, a little bit sick. Uh, there's my room in the background there. You can see. I I don't know if you can see, but over there is where I film my ranty stuff. Uh, ranty. Uh, how old were you when you learned how to ride a bike? Funny story. I don't know how to ride a bike yet because as as a kid, I always rode the bike with the things on the side, I can't remember what they're called, on the sides of the wheels, and then as I grew up, we never went to parks as often, and I really didn't like bicycles, so I never got, I never got bothered to ride a bike, and my school is not really that close to home, so I can't even ride my bike there, I don't have a bike, so even if I did, I couldn't have rode out there. So, it's, it's just pretty much pointless. How many oceans have you swam in? None. I've swam in pretty several seas, but no no oceans. Um, how many countries have you been to? Two, here and Egypt. Uh, here being Saudi Arabia, of course. Uh, is anyone in your family in the army? Well, technically one is going to the army in the next few months, I think. It's my brother. But technically somebody is, but none of them currently. Uh, I'm going to have a sip because it's the 10 mark and stuff. What would you name your daughter if you had one? Uh, if I had a daughter, which is not going to happen because I'm not going to have any children. I'm going to be the first one to just have all the babies in the world. I just say that and then I'm just, when I grow up, I'm just going to have all the babies in the world. Uh, what would you name your daughter if you had one? I'd probably name her Sarah. Not because my sister's name is Sarah, it's just because I like the name Sarah. Uh, it's a very lovely name. Uh, what what would you name your son if you had one? Uh, Sherlock, <laughs> no. Um, I don't know. I actually don't know. I, di I don't know. It's very hard to think of names. Uh, ben? I might name him Ben. It's quite a lovely name. Uh, what's the worst grade you got on a test? The worst grade I got on a test was probably a B plus, I think. Like, that's the worst grade I've ever got on a test. And then again, I'm in my freshman year of high school. Don't look like it, but I am. Yeah, B minus. B, B plus, excuse me, was the, uh, was the lowest grade I've ever got on a test. You can tell I'm pretty an average uh, thing. Child? No, not child. I hate when someone says I'm a child. I'm technically still a child, but I hate when someone says that. Uh, uh, what's your favourite TV show when you were a child? I think it might be a tie between Tom and Jerry and Spongebob. Because I never really watched The Simpsons. That never came on Arabian television. It was just Spongebob and Tom, Tom and Jerry and Looney Tunes. Like That's the only three things that actually came up. Another sip here. Uh, what did you dress up as on Halloween when you were eight? I don't celebrate Halloween. I didn't even, when I was eight, I didn't even know what the hell Halloween was because I live in Saudi Arabia. Have you read any of the Harry Potter Hunger Games or Twilight series? I've read a little bit of Harry Potter. I, div I never finished any of the books because they're way too goddamn long. Uh, Hunger Games and Twilight, I, I watched uh, the first part of the Hunger Games and the first part of Twilight. I like the first part of the Hunger Games. The second part made me hate the whole bloody series and Twilight I just hated it from the beginning. One of the main reasons I hate Twilight it's because it it's it's the main core of Fifty Shades of Grey because Fifty Shades of Grey originally started as a Twilight fan fiction. So yeah. Uh, would you rather have an American accent or a British accent? Guess. Uh, British, of course, because it's it sounds much more sophisticated. It just sounds way much better. It's, it's way much cooler. I feel like Sherlock Holmes or James Bond or something like that. Did your mother go to college? <laughs> yes, of course. Uh, are your grandparents still married? Well, actually, we've got one grandparent still alive. Like, two of them died before I was even born. And one of them died like three or four years ago. And so I have only the mother of my mother. Uh, or my grandma. Uh, as you probably should say. Um, still alive. So yeah. No. Technically not. Uh, have you ever... T uh, hang on. It's the 10 uh, question mark again. I'm going to have a sip. 
Ahem. That was the worst cleaning of the throat ever. Have you ever taken karate lessons? Technically, yes, but also no. We've taken like basic karate lessons um, at school, which is like how to punch and stuff, but we never like went into depth with them. Do you know who Kermit the Frog is? Yes, I do know who Kermit the Frog is. I, I'm gonna have to scroll down here in two seconds. There we are. Do you know who Kermit the Frog is? Yes, I do know who Kermit the Frog is. I just never watched the show. What is the first amusement park you've ever been to? Never went to an amusement park because here in Saudi Arabia we don't have amusement parks and in Egypt they're just way too goddamn expensive. So I never went to an amusement park. We have tiny little amusement parks in malls and stuff, but like these are technically the amusement parks I used to go to. Uh, what language besides uh, your native language would you like to be fluent in? I think I I think I th I like to think myself as fluent in English. So I think it would be either Spanish or German because they are very difficult languages. French I can manage. I'm just way too lazy to actually study it. Do you spell the color as gray with an e or gray with an a? Uh, I spell it as a gray with an a, not an e, uh, which is something I've got quite a lot of slack for. Uh, in my school because we take the American curriculum, not the British and in America they spell it with an E, not an A. Is your father bald? Uh, no he's not. His father and all of his um, brothers uh, are bald. He's the lucky one that escaped. If he wasn't I'd probably be, st I'd probably start losing hair right about now. But, uh, but I like my hair. I actually want to make it like long I want to be, I, I want to have long hair, you know, sort of 80s rock star kind of thing, but I can't because whenever I do, the school just bitches about it all day, so I don't like that. Um, where is it? Uh, do you know triplets? No. I know, like, I know twins from, like, a distance. They're like a friend of a friend of mine, but I don't know triplets. Uh, do you prefer Titanic or The Notebook? Titanic because, uh, well, purely because I didn't watch Notebook. Because, like, you see, I watched Titanic because it had a little bit of action, uh, and I never watched Notebook because I don't like uh, romance. Not even romance comedy. I just hate romance. Have you ever had Indian food? No. Surprisingly, because we are surrounded by a lot of Indians here in Saudi Arabia. I'm not surrounded by them. They're very well. They're, there's a lot of Indians in Saudi Arabia. Uh, it's sounding like I'm I'm disrespecting them. No disrespect. I love Indians. Uh, although I don't know any of them personally, but no, I never had Indian food. Uh, <laughs> I just keep going off topic for some reason. What is the name of your favorite? Uh, restaurant. Didn't go to much restaurants, but it probably will be Steakhouse. I went once and the food there was amazing. It is expensive as ass though. As ass? That's... <laughs> Asses are expensive apparently now. Uh, what's the... yeah. Uh, have you ever been to Olive Garden? Yeah, Olive Garden. Uh, no, I've never been to Olive Garden simply because, again, I live in Saudi Arabia. Do you be... I... my life is just so boring. What the hell am I... why am I doing this? Do you belong to any warehouse stores? No, I do not. I'm gonna have to scroll down again. Good grief. Um, down we go. Uh, t -t 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 there we go. What would what would your parents have named you if we if you were the opposite gender? I actually know what they would have named me. I just uh, actually we hit the bloody ten questions mark and I haven't taken a sip yet. That's fine. Uh, uh, where's the thing? Uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I, I can't, I can't remember what they would have named me. They've said, they've told me what they, uh, what they would have named me if I was on the opposite gender, but, um, I can't remember currently. If you have a nickname, what is it? It's right here. It's Himo Adan. But Adan is my last name. Uh, but Himo is what everybody, uh, seems to call me by. Uh, so I used it in my Facebook and YouTube account. Uh, where's the thing? Uh, who's your favorite person in the world? Now, I'm gonna just put religion aside here. Just, just put it to the side because I don't like talking about religion. Um, probably be my family, like, as equals. 
if if the question was like who's the most person you like click with in your family or it's the most person you open up to probably me my biggest brother because he, although he is eight years older than me or nine i think i can't remember i can't remember how old my brother is for me jesus i'm i'm the most horrible brother in it in the world but yeah i we kind of grew up in the same you know era where stuff was happening and so he knows what i feel we have we like the same stuff we like so much of the same stuff uh, and so yeah my brother probably thing uh would you rather live in a rural area uh or the suburbs uh i don't know i'd rather live in none of them because i'm used to living in the city because uh, a funny story when i used to when i uh, my place in egypt my house was next to the one of the busiest roads in Cairo and so when we moved out to a much much quieter uh, place I, I, I was used to s sleeping with horns and stuff going off all day and when I slept in in the new home um, which was completely silent I couldn't sleep because I was used to that constant beeping sound in my ears um, but 36 can you whistle uh, a little bit not much I'm not gonna try it because if I do I probably cuff my heart out uh, <coughs> as I just demonstrated do you sleep with a nightlight technically I do because I have these sort of uh, markers on like the what do you call them the electricity port things which tell you what volt they are and they are uh, it's either red or blue and uh, uh, the lights and so they're pretty damn high and they they create shadows in my room so I technically do sleep with a nightlight do you eat breakfast every morning no I actually don't eat breakfast at all I just wake up get ready and go to school where is it uh, do you take any pills or medication daily yes I do I actually started taking a uh, calcium thingy today uh, because I don't want to get sick like for the past month I've been sick for every single week I don't know what it is I just been sick on and off on and off and I wanted to take this uh, vitamin so I don't get sick because I hate being sick it's boring uh, what medical conditions do you have I don't have anything luckily hooray I technically have a broken toe but it's a very tiny little piece and they can't you know it can't get healed uh, because it's a very very tiny little piece uh, and so I technically have a broken toe what uh, how many times have you been to the hospital way too much I've been uh, to the hospital way too much uh, I, I, I don't know who counts how many times I've been to the hospital but a lot have you ever seen Finding Nemo yes I have watched it uh, Seven billion times, uh, because it's an amazing movie. Where do you buy your jeans? At the store. <laughs> because <coughs> I really don't want to say a brand, because it will probably be like advertising. I again broke my rule of taking a sip every ten things. Uh, where do you buy your jeans? Uh, at the store, again. Uh, what's the last compliment you got? Well, it was today, because today is my birthday, and everybody's telling me happy birthday. I just I want to thank you. It's a bit late in the video, but I want to thank you uh, if you have said happy birthday to me. It, it feels great to, you know, know that somebody cares about you, apart from your family. Uh, it's a very nice experience. Experience? It's a very nice feeling. That's what I was going for. Um, where is the thing? Uh, do you usually remember your dreams in the morning? Uh, if it's a very good slash bad dream, yes. If not, then I just ignore it. What flavoured tea do you enjoy? I don't drink tea. I hate tea to death. I just don't like tea. Like, I am, I'm drinking this thing with, like, a dagger in my heart because I really don't want to drink it. The thing is, that's the, the thing that's making me drink it is that it will just make me feel better. So that's the only thing uh, that is uh, making me drink it. Anyways, uh, how many pairs of shoes do you currently own? There's that, that three. Yeah, 
three. Three pairs of shoes. There's one that's a little bit old. There's one football shoes. And then there's the newest one, which is amazing. Uh, where's the thing? Uh, what religion will you raise your children to practice? Islam, because I'm a Muslim, again. Uh, how old were you when you found out Santa wasn't real? Well, five? Because it's when I knew that Christmas was a thing and sing was a thing and that we didn't celebrate Christmas and Christ and Santa was not real. Uh, so, uh, do you have a Tumblr? No, because if I did, everybody would be hating it and I just don't like Tumblr. Uh, that, wow, that's the end of the questions. 50. Uh, now, I should... Uh, I, th this is the rule. I should tag someone to answer these questions. Uh, but... Nobody, nobody should answer these questions. They're pretty boring, and I, I, I don't hate you. I like you guys. This is my birthday special, and I'm not gonna be a dickhead. Uh, so yeah, it's the end of it. Thank you very much for watching this very boring slash sick, uh, vlog Q and A type thing. Uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching, and ta-ra.